welcome back to our five minute Chinese. Wu fen zhong. Fen zhong means minute. We have to learn that. Wu fen zhong, Chinese Zhongwen. Mm. In the past episodes, we learned a little bit about time. Still remember how to say yesterday? Zuo tian. How to say today? Jing tian. How to say tomorrow? Ming tian. How to say every day? Tian tian. So, I know we learned also, uh, we also learned the number. So, someone asked me, Hey, Ping, um, so Monday means Yi Tian. Tuesday means Er Tian. You're very smart, but sorry, it's not correct. Okay, t today, let's figure out how to say Monday, how to say Tuesday, how to say Wednesday, how to say Thursday, how to say Friday, how to say Saturday, how to say Sunday. So, wow, today in five minutes, we will learn seven new words. Yes, are you ready? Yes, you're ready. Let me tell you, it's super easy. Probably in one minute, in one minute, you can figure out. You can remember, you can master all the seven words. The most important word we will learn. The key word we will learn. The word we decide whether you can remember the seven words in one minute is how to say week. Week, W-E-E-K. Like this week, I'm going to Boston. Wow, really? Yeah, this week, I will go to Boston. <laughs> week, week, how's your week? Could you tell me how to say that? Louder! Xinqi, Xinqi. Remember, when you are practicing at home, Please be confident. What I mean is try your best to say that as loud as you can. As loud as you can. Uh-huh. Okay. Now why we learn learning Because Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Saturday, Sunday in Chinese. Very easy to say. Week plus number. So what do you mean? I'll give you one example. You, you will forgot, uh, figure out the rest of six by yourself. Monday in Chinese is Xian Qi number. You got it? Because that is how we say the day of the week. How we say the day of the week in Chinese? We always put a week plus the number. Here, and represents number, not noun. Number. Always the Xinqi go first, then the number. Because we believe in our culture, we believe Monday is the first day of the week. Probably in your culture, in your religion, you believe Sunday is a week. But in Chinese, this language, we, we believe Monday is the first day of the week. So this is a little bit culture difference here. Uh -huh. I hope you can remember this. And Tuesday, same format. Same format, could you figure out about it? Yes, Tuesday is Xinqi Er. Since we learned number two, right? E Er. How to say Wednesday? Xinqi San. Yeah, we learned San. Remember? E Er San. How to say Thursday? Xinqi Si. Great. How to say Friday? Xinqi Wu. Xinqi Wu. Five. Saturday, Xinqi Liu. Because Liu means the sixth. Sunday. Xing qi qi. Xing qi qi. Sorry, you're wrong. We have to do something special. Otherwise, Chinese is so simple. It's so easy. I'm sorry. 
lives. This is our philosophy. When you think, "Hey, I'm so smart. I figured out everything," boom, you're wrong. You're wrong. Uh huh. Sunday is one exception. We don't say 星期七 We say 星期天 Sunday day 星期天 or 星期日星期日 This is for Sunday. Sunday is very special. What is the difference? 星期天 is more over. 星期天 is more over. 星期日 is more formal. It's more formal. You got it? Uh huh. So again, let's do it again. How to say Monday? 星期一 How to say Tuesday? 星期二 How to say Wednesday? 星期三 How to say Thursday? 星期四 Friday? 星期五 Saturday? 星期六 Sunday. Sunday. 星期天 or 星期日 You figure out as long as you can remember how to count number. And you can remember how to say week. You will have no problem to say all the seven words from Monday to Sunday. That is what I mean. Say it in one minute. You figure out all the seven words. That is how efficient our five minute Chinese it is. <laughs> Please recommend our video to anyone you know、uh, who is interested in learning Chinese. We want to more and more people to watch our video and enjoy our video and give us the feedback. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.